Hello, everybody, and welcome back to 60 Parsecs. I am your host, AJ Bucky Chan. Now, last episode, I'll admit, I kind of dropped the ball on that one. I saw a French cat, and I was like, yeah, everyone else can get screwed. And by doing so, I came to a couple realizations. One, I think I need to start getting more rations at the beginning because the rations do last you a couple days, but I only had like three starting out and i know i got more but those go really quick i think i need to start also crafting rations more as well but other than that i think it's just you know as they say bad leadership can't be my fault it has to be their fault you know i am the captain i take no responsibility for what just happened so as on all good captain does i am going to try again i'm gonna do voyager and i am probably gonna pick i'm gonna pick i like I, I like being the intelligent. I like having intelligence. I think intelligence is fun. And, you know, cause thinking everything out. I can also pick an average character. Like, an extremely average character does does something, everything. Okay. Not great. But let's see where this actually gets us. So, we need to do soup for sure. And probably a gas mask. I feel like that is a good, you know thing I, I can do all right and then down here there she is so i can i can get three out of the way pretty quick oh those are materials okay i don't think i'll need to get the artifact because i could just make that one okay i need it let me get her let me get her oh it's megan again oh how fun get her and let me get the soups here I think I'll, I think I'll still get some crafting materials just to have them. Yeah, so that that feels good. Let me get the puppet as well, and I'll go ahead and take. I'll take the artifact. I know I said I wasn't going to get it, but I can always use it. All right, and then I might have one, one more loop. Come on, come on! I don't know how to get in there. Come on. No, fuck! Shit! Fuck. Ugh, fuck, get in there, get in there. Oh, okay. Alright. It's quiet. Oh, God! Oh! So, that felt good. That actually, that actually felt pretty decent. I got... You know, I feel like I got plenty of rations. I got the artifact. I got some crafting materials. I got the sock puppet. I got all my crew members are, are fully there. I just I didn't get any of the uh, the crafting materials to make rations, so that's going to be a little bit of an issue. But I feel good. Got the communicator. That's also a good one too. But in that last run, I don't feel like the communicator helped me that much. Excuse me. I felt like it, it kind of screwed me in a way. So I also realized you don't need to... I, I was sitting like this. I was like, okay, let me figure something out. I feel like I don't need, you know, my hands. All right, yeah, so that's just more of the same. Oh, yeah, so I have to wait till it come back. Intelligent speech. Obviously being really smart. I need to know how many days it is. Because I think, you know... You know exactly what to say. Yeah. So now I can actually craft stuff. I'm going to craft. Oh, so, okay. Oh, okay. So I'm getting them backwards. Okay. So I'm going to. I am going to make a first aid kit. Get that out of the way as quick as possible. All right. You say are in these situations, right? I hate raising my volume by that. My functioning body odor removal is, is making a racket. I think it's malfunctioning. Uh, we're not worried about it. Unless leaving stuff up like causes you to, to lose your sanity, I think we'll be fine. Good news, bad news. Protocol dictates I deliver bad news first. The body odor removal filter is no longer working. Ergo, the smell. The good news is the noise is gone. It wasn't an essential system, not for me anyway. Your crewmates appear to be disappointed by the smell. April remains loyal. That's my girl. Still through thick and thin. Game would need a core mechanic. Let's do the lighter. Hell, if I burn some shit down, we'll burn some shit down. Let's make this more spicy. Let's make it a little bit more exciting. 
Anyone hurt? Anyone hurt? Hey, the lighter's still good. Chase the crew around the shuttle. First thing you were chasing got burned. They owe you 10 push-ups. You played until you realized how much the fire made you miss Earth. At least you could camp there. Remember camping? You and your crew sat next to the lighter thinking about roasting marshmallows. How lovely. Captain, it's important to keep yourself and your crew well fed. Okay, routine supply check. Intelligence. I'll do it because I think I, I think you get three from from him from me doing it, don't you? Well, yeah, I think you get more. Oh, what? Meg one supplies went missing, and the current number suit is eight. Yeah, just don't eat all at once. Crafting kit. Okay, so I'm gonna, now I'm going to make soup. All right, what we got here? Captain, it's time for a life or death challenge. The most humble task available on the shuttle: keeping the floor clean. Uh, April looks free. Uh, I'll have her use some elbow grease. You're loyal, right? Even to this day? Even if I make you get on your hands and knees and scrub? <laughs> Why am I like this? I'll make some more soup while I can before it starts getting crazy. What is this? Your attention is required, Captain. This is the most abnormal. We are registering unknown transmissions, but I cannot identify who is sending them, and more importantly, what they, are, what they contain. It might be a solar flare interference or worse, a new type of Soviet encryption. I need to decipher these signals as soon as possible, for all we know our survival depends on it. Um, she's clever. But I'm brilliant. So I'm going to be in charge. I'm going to be the one to... I I'll talk to the alien species. Don't worry. I am, I am very brilliant. Why did I get an artifact? Did I pick up the artifact? I think I did. Okay. You need to see this. I'm not easy excited, but this is human AI like we're not alone in this universe did I did I do this one did I I don't remember if I I I legitimately do not remember if I did that last the first time yep so, oh my god star oh my god yes absolutely so about a sprinkler system I don't know but I'm gonna use my brains to fix it I'm just that just that intelligent just that smart Disable sprinkler system as soon as the flooding started. That gave you enough time to fix the sprinklers. I had to report that our supplies, planet, our planet, whatever you're flying to is getting closer. ETA T4. So four days. DD, listen, it'll get better. I promise you. I'm just going to sleep in there again. Do I give them food now or do I wait until they just turn starving? I wait till they just turn starving because I don't want to blow, you know, my soup load. All over the place right now. Hey yo, what the fuck? Okay, so everyone's starving. Okay, that's what we'll do. Uh, can't do anything. Everyone is starving. Wonderful. Okay, so now everyone, everyone, I think is just gonna be hungry. I think it just increases a level. Let's see here. Oh yeah, I hold a vote while you're asleep, and I won one to zero. Fending the machine and I. The, vi the machine, I mean, had to go. She would have driven me crazy with her limited programming. Yeah, I couldn't have done anything. Uh, so yeah, everyone's just hungry. So that's what it does. It just moves up a level. Instead of it actually, you know, re completely removing it. Which is fine. I think I think if I could keep hovering around hungry to starving, I think I'll be okay. But do I get rid of the artifact? What does getting rid of the artifact do for me? Be able to make one p ration. Mm. I'm I'm actually like curious. Uh, I'll get rid of the artifact. Let's see. We are entering a field of cosmic gas. Uh, I remember her doing it last time, and I got like a bunch of uh, materials from it. So, I hope the same thing happens again. It, wait, what? Oh. So it's random. Okay. She will reduce... Oh, okay. So that's what the rolls are. They give you... Everyone's loyal. Nice. Yep. So we'll do the lighter. Something bad's probably going to happen. But I don't really care. Because we need to do this. Yeah. And I think tomorrow, I think it's, is it five days that people start starving? 
lights are back on, turns out the issue was only a dead fuse. Now what chewed through these with this tiny razor sharp spiral teeth? Oh. Oh, I don't like that. Wake up, we're approaching some sort of celestial body, it resembles a moon. Okay, scan, 96, 90, 100%. It was right, smaller component with no organic life forms. A lot of movement down there. Strange, my scanners detect some caves and rock formations. Uh, Captain, if you want to land on this planet safely, you'll have to fix up a small... You'll have to fix up a small malfunction with our steering system, since we're not even able to turn. Oh, and you'll have to hurry before we float away from the planet. Oh, lighter! Lighter's never failed me yet, and it's not going to fail me now. Ooh. Oh! Oh, it, uh, I did do this last. I did do this la last time. Oh. And this get the source of the mysterious transmission. What? Okay, so now people can go on ex on excavations now. Yeah. Uh. Who do I want to send out there, though? What hazard is this? What's in April? Uh, April's April's average on everything. I'm gonna give her some soup. Is I mean, if if there was a if it was like a uh, what's the word? I mean, if it was like that, the hazard. I could use the gas mask. But I think she'll be okay with just some soup to eat. Okay. That's what we'll do. Captain, we're going to take transmission. Yeah, let's. we got to communicate. Try to hurry up and get that done as soon as possible. On expeditions. I didn't know expeditions were, were available that soon. I thought it was something that you had to unlock later. But she's out there now. Fix the shuttle's communication system. Check goal section for details. Await further instruction. Await contact. So that's all I gotta do. Hmm. Interesting. So I could do it from here. Everyone's good. Hungry, hunger, starving. So I can do it from. Oh! Oh! Wonderful. Oh, why don't I just ration soup to all? Wonderful. Wonderful. Uh, I remember the ro the roaches being good. I think they're like the, ro the Petersons. Yeah, they're good. Hey, they could chill. They're not hurting anyone. Unless they decide to hurt each other! Okay, no, I'm just kidding. Just kidding. Oh, they're gone. What? Yeah, they're yeah, good. They're hey, they could chill. chill. We eat in your soup. <gasps> we eat in your soup! <laughs> I will never trust a cockroach again. What's this? While doing a routine cleanup up in my database, I found flux capacitor. Nope, last time I did that, I blew up. And we're not going to do that again. Because that, that hurty a lot. Be wary of the space communists. Oh! So now I have tape. Wonderful. Are you starving? Are you starving? Are you starving? Then you ain't eating. There's a robot city passing outside. Yes, Starlight City is mobile. Floats above. Technology is far more advanced. Maybe they could help you. One might be able to catch up if you run fast. Average, average, average. Is it agility? Limber. Hang on, I'll get back to that in a second. I, I actually, is there like a, I thought there would be like a number. Honestly, flexible, l limber. Which one's better? Is, is it, I'm gonna send Megan. Megan, my, my science officer friend. Run like the wind, bullseye. Run like the wind. Hey, bro, you made it. Oh, oh. Oh, wonderful, wonderful. Is everyone starving? <laughs> Megan, are you starving? Mm -hmm. Not Megan, what's your name? Yep, everyone's starving. <sighs> Let's just ration all. That's what we'll do. And then upgrade. Okay, now I can upgrade shit. Okay, so what what do I upgrade? Do I upgrade the crafting module or do I upgrade the exposition system? I'll do the exposition system because I feel like Are you hurt? Hungry weak. Street sickness, injuries in the plague. 
stops insanity. She's not injured. She's weak and tired. So I don't know what that's going to do. Wait. Is my communicator broken? <sighs> Damn it. Airlock came the droid pulled open the door with incredible force and walked into the cabin. Where a game knocked into the walls and will crew all screaming in binary. It didn't seem to want to hurt you or anything. This morning it woke from its stupor and left clutching its head unit. It must have been the morning after the night before. But sleepless night along with the image left you in the court more, more than edged as ever. Everyone's just hungry. April is just weak. I don't think you're weak, April. I think you're strong. Now, if sentient roaches you showed mercy to have finally made themselves at home here on the shuttle. Um. Yeah, I'm asking them to keep down. Cause you know what? Fuck them. Fuck them roaches. They disrespected me. I'm disrespecting them. Fuck these roaches. Bark! Why am I bark? What? what? You approached the roach hole and spoke calmly to Pete Peterson, the patriarch of the family. About not rousing such a ruckus. Ro roachly ruckus. The, kind, the kindly roach apologized profusely and confessed the experiments that gave his family a sit and tea and since I left him a bit hard of hearing. Glad you were for spaghetti, although you had to decline due to your inability to fit inside his kitchen. Captain detected an SOS signal coming from somewhere on the planet. I will do the necessary calculations to pinpoint the exact location. Expect more details soon. Alright. So now... I can upgrade? I'm going to upgrade the first aid kit. Just to see what that actually does. Captain, there's supposed to be an error, error, error. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Intelligence. I don't know what Braun would do. I guess... <laughs> I mean, I guess hitting it, but... WHAM! Hello, everybody, and... Can I actually fix the commuter... Craft... Why can't I craft the communicator? Alright, I need something that actually gives me... Yeah, I gotta get rid of the stock puppet. Yep. Because not, not, not having the communicator right now has actually screwed me over more than... Having, like, the sock puppet. <sighs> Shit. I gotta send someone out to get food. Let's see. Where can I send people at? Is there soup? Is there like a, is there actually like a, a chance to get soup? Let's see. What is these dangers? What are these dangers? All right. Um. Uh. I guess I'll do assembly line. That sounds good. I am going to send DD. Yeah. And I'm actually going to give her the gas mask. I can't really give her anything else. But I'm just going to give her the gas mask. Let's see what that does. Pete Peterson is requesting if you can help him make some improvements to his family home, Captain. Uh, the roach is next door building a miniature indoor swimming pool in one of the shuttle drain pipes. Pete says he needs something heavy to finish the project. What will you lend him? Absolutely nothing, because I have nothing for his roach ass. Alright, okay, now I can fix the communicator. Okay, now I'm going to do that. The more I know we're after the Peterson's roach hole, the problem appears to be an argument between Petey and Patterson. Well, some disputes are normal among isolated group of individuals. This sounds like a serious problem. Yes, I am going to check on them. Why? Because they ate my soup, and I wonder if it's still there. Now, if they kill me, that's on them. For God, there's been some commute. Pete was so grateful he invited you over sometime to throw the old dust ball around. But you declined, saying that you're too big. Uh... I'm going to drop the package. Alien herbs. Let's uh, fuck it. Let's let's light it up. Who's starving? Okay. I need to eat. I'm gonna be honest. I'm sorry, everyone. If I die, this whole thing is over. But uh, the crew like to smell of herbs. So you lit the leaves out to freshen the air. Everyone sat on the floors for hours. 
the crew and then to the carb sharper to use again like oh <laughs> you smoked weed there's some cheese in the pantry did someone sneak it on board was it infection was it french <laughs> that's what that's your marriage yes i will eat the cheese why because i'm a smart man who knows deep down that nothing bad can come from this Nothing, Nothing bad, bad can bad come bad from bad this. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna give soup to everyone. Is anyone hurt? Nope. Rest its old can. Yeah, last time I did this, I got more cans. What's the worst that could happen? After day 27. Yeah. So yeah, that was such a good call. Oh my god, Chan, you are incredible. Thank you, Chan. We've got to get out there. Bring the armor, you'll probably get shot at, and bring the first aid kit. I mean, hell, if you lose all that, then you're kind of you're kind of worthless. But looks like uh, Satan himself is going to be over there, so you might want to watch out. Check your back, check your six, so stay frosty. Um, best kill, feeling better? Yeah, can't really do anything. Don't yell at me. Quick, let's eat. Let's. Quick, let's let's eat the food. Quick, quick, let's eat the food while she's gone. Quick, eat the food while she's gone. Oh, <sighs> shit! Fuck! I, I'm not reading it. Like, if I can't do anything, I'm not going to read it. The Darwin and Predator droid held you in its grip. You cursed the weakness of your human body out loud. Oh, what? In his ulcerage, the droid preached about evolution. You edged it closer to the airlock, then pushed it out mid-lecture. You're safe. The droid's verdict inspired dark thoughts in your head. Are you fit for survival? Or are you the weak link? Uh, yeah. Yeah, so I'm great. That was, that was wonderful. Upgrade. Let's upgrade. Can I repair the dog? I feel like that's something I can do. Uh, no resources. What do you mean, no resources? Like, no maidens? Make some more soup. That feels great. Your attempts to fix the robotic dog found at the old assembly line have been quite a struggle so far. You've been fiddling with this loose cable all morning. Can it be removed? What does it do? What does it even do? It's been a few days since you found this unfortunate cable sticking out of the robotic dog's complicated insides. Whatever for, 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 for. Reconnect it. Tape. Obviously. Wonderful. Why would I not use tape? It's clearly going to be electric tape. Nothing bad's going to happen! You found the ears to the plug. Very similar, but not an exact match. You forced the wire into the free connection and secured it with duct tape. I can't say I approve of your methods, but at least the cable's not dangling anymore. Yeah, let's just keep... I mean, let's just keep making food. DD's good. I'm good. Oh, wow. Cool. Now I need the artifact. Great! Great. Wow, no, don't do that. Great. Great! Day 31. God, I hope hope she is not dead forever. Def, you threw a couple insults. Yeah, so I lost the suit, but I gained a suit. So I didn't really lose anything. Okay. We are at Pathfish. Get camera standard sabotage. Our air filters, they need to be protected. But I lost the remote control due to micro damage. Stocks of tornadoes close enough that it's going out there with that prop equipment would be suicide. Uh, I yeah, my mask. Good thing I kept that mask. Jesus. Good thing I didn't give it to her. Hey! Good thing you held on to the proper gear to get out there and manually close out the air filters. Even with your mask, braving the toxic winds wasn't accept was wasn't something you'd like to do again. The shuttle will get a bit scruffy, stuffy before I have the chance to filter any fresh air, but it beats suffocating to death. Once the winds pass over us, we'll reopen the filters and things will return back to normal. Oh, what? Our visit to the museum was rather educational. Did you know the inhabitants of this planet were actually created by a different race that lived here before them? So she got a rock, got the gun. You still count on friendship, complaining about the lack of rations. Megan is weak and Megan is tired. Everyone's just hungry. Nothing really talk about. Captain, there's been a sudden loss of energy from our non-essential systems. I've back traced the leak, and it's the family of roaches again, the Petersons. They found a way to re reroute our electricity. So electricity is being used for Patty's new vanity mirror, which her loving husband, Pete Peterson, is building. How will you address this? Um, With tape. Listen. 
I would not be as hostile to them if they didn't commit the ultimate sin of taking food out of my mouth. Why do I keep bumping into you? He taped the roach hole shut and told Peter Peterson he wouldn't remove the tape until he agreed not to steal energy from the ship. The guy on the roach apologized and said he had no idea it was against protocol for him to borrow your electricity. Seeing as the two of you were neighbors, his wife Patty offered to bake you her specialty, a hair follicle tart, which you declined. You could use some more rations. I think everyone is just... Repair, mask. I don't really think I need to repair the mask yet, but I'm going to craft the soup. Metal detector showing a piece of ancient robot technology buried a few paces from the shuttle. I don't know how this is possible, but it's a coffee maker, a fancy one. Uh, yeah. Yes. Dee Dee. I think Dee Dee probably needs to go out there next. Uh. I don't know what that is, but that does not look safe. I mean, people have literally fought off the devil, so. We'll do Dee Dee. Dee Dee! Uh, I don't think Dee Dee should take a gun. Well, we'll have her take armor. And. She's not starving. But I will give her soup. And I hope that doesn't, like. I hope they eat it while they're out there, because I know she's really close to starving. And I hope she eats it out there, which brings her back. Okay, you and Megan dug up the fancy coffee maker, discovered it was still full of beans, genetically engineered to meet robot tastes, meaning the longest lasting and best tasting in the universe. They were still good. You sat and shared the most amazing cup of coffee you've ever had in your lives. Philosophies, philosophizing for hours about how the robots were able to perfect this once exclusively human art form. Didi went out to check the charging hub, party time. Now that Dee has gone, we can actually have a party. Megan remains weak. Megan remains hungry. You are starving, Captain. I recommend you find something to eat. Hell yeah. What else do I have here, actually? What 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 can I make? Uh, let's upgrade the gun. No, no. Yeah, let's upgrade the gun. Because I'm going to give myself some food. I'm scratching my arm. I don't know. I'm not leaning like this. Just, just lean like this. Probably It probably looked weird. And I apologize. All right. An alien vessel is approaching. Their ship is rigged with a light show. Sing to the music, they start blasting as soon as we open comms. Captain, they're playing Rockabilly. Megan is already grooving to the beat. The aliens claim to be of the Dance Lord tribe and are searching for the best dancers in the galaxy. They challenge our tribe to a dance off, specifically a sock hop. If you don't accept, they will vaporize us with their ultra high frequency speakers. Uh, we're flexible. You need that flexibility to schmoove. You know, a little limber. You know, pop up. Pop up. <laughs> Oh God, <laughs> Papa, Papa! I don't want to say it. I don't want to say it. I'm not going to say it. I am not going to say it. I am not going to say it. I'm not going to say it. You can't make me say it. Uh, we lost the dance off. When the aliens beat you up, you both stumbled onto the dance floor, and it was all downhill from there. Poor rhythm, shoddy footwork. Not even a pair of sequin jackets could save you. Your dance was honored. Anyone bravely enough to step onto the holy dance floor, but your leadership war bop spared you. But warn that you'd be better you better have sweeter moves next time. You did all you could to fix the robotic animal, but both your tool selection and lim technology know how we're limited. If you were set on mending the sad pile of scrap vaguely reminiscent of a dog, you'll have to gather some actual parts from around the planet. My advice is to take a good look at the map and consider what you've already explored. I'm sure robot parts are easy enough to get a hold of around here, but some locations are certainly more promising than others, such as the graveyard or the museum. Okay. So it looks like I need to go to the museum. Okay. That's it. That's it. That, you know what? Not not trying to... I mean, that sounds fair. That sounds fair. Sir, do you hear that? Roll up, roll up. Roll up for Captain Cerberus' Cosmic Carnival. Can you shave a scoat's eyeballs within 30 tachyons? Can you answer a pop quiz at 10 Gs? Try your hand and win valuable prizes. There's a floating pantagalactic fun fair outside. Two games look pertinent, a zero-g wire loop game and a space-time bending maze. Text your dexterity or your mind. I am the smartest man in all of the cosmos, all right? There's not gonna be some time bending maze that I can't solve. Oh, cool. Blew off your side, Zorba's labyrinth and into the sleeping wormhole. Zorbator, you say focus and swiftly found the route out. 
The manager, a sentient clown costume, begrudgingly handed over a battery. Okay. I mean, I'm gonna make some more soup, I and mean, I have to. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! 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 It cannot end like this. It cannot. Okay. Whoa! Whoa! No! After you make and discovered all the ugly symbols from my shuttle, you decided to keep your heads down and pretend they didn't exist. There were more and more symbols cropping up. One even kept appearing right in the shuttle window. One of you flew back was turned on a very thick but doubt. Dee is gone. I told you she probably parted herself to death in the city. Well, that's gonna that's gonna break. I'll make the artifact. I, uh, what was it, the graveyard? Uh, Megan, I have to send you out there. I'm sorry. I mean, I'm gonna send you out there with some soup. Megan, I'm sorry. Captain, we about a horde of robotic penguins have. Yeah, uh, we're gonna use the gun. About time I can finally use it to blast on some people. Let's see. Brace the door shut and crouch with the gun in your hand, praying it would be enough to stop the horde of murderous yard penguins. Or at least let you take some of them with you. But after a few hours, you got sick of waiting and opened the door. The penguins were gone. There was only an, an obscene shape carved in the dirt in front of the shuttle. Wow, real mature, guys. Alright. Looks like we're getting toward the end of this run. Um, probably going to do one more episode. Uh, probably just to see how long it's going to be before we end. Hopefully not by space communists. But it's all going to shit. But you guys are going down with me because I am the captain. And the captain must always go down with the ship. So thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you in the next episode. This is Agent Blackie Chan. Signing off, guys.